Good morning, Indians. Welcome back to another episode of INN. My name is Jamie. And my name is Stefan. Let's get started with the pledge. Good morning, Indians. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. The Glow Club will be meeting tomorrow, December 5th, at lunch in Mr. Stanford's room, room 250. We recently won a $500 grant from the PS Gay Men's Chorus. We hope to see you there. The Spanish Honor Society will be hosting a dance called La Flor de Noche Buena with live band and music this Saturday at the Pavilion, December 9th from 7 to 11 p.m. The tickets will be sold at $50. Only 260 tickets will be sold, so make sure to get yours as soon as possible. Indians, the winter rally is coming up and we want you to MC. If interested, MC auditions will be held this Thursday, December 7th at lunch in the Black Box. We hope to see you there. Attention class of 2024, your senior panoramic picture is set for this Wednesday, December 6th at the football stadium. We will be taking the picture during fourth period and you will need to report to your fourth period class first before heading down to the stadium. We are asking all seniors to wear black, red or white for the picture. Please save the date. Indians, please help make the holidays happy for needy children here in the Coachella Valley by donating a toy to our annual toy drive. We will be working with The Narrow Door, a charitable organization here in the Valley, to help families by donating toys. The toy drive will end the week of final exams, so please bring your toys in as soon as possible. Winter formal dance tickets will be going on sale during final exam next week. For the low price of only $40 with IP and $45 without, couple tickets will be $80. The dance will once again be held at the Palm Springs Aerial Chamway, but this year we have a limit on the number of tickets we can sell. Be one of the lucky 400 students who can attend the coldest dance of the year and get your tickets early while they're still available. Only 50 guest passes will be sold, so make sure you get yours as soon as possible. Indians, it is important to get to your classes on time. If you're early, you're on time. If you're on time, you're late. And if you're late, you're left behind. Don't be left behind. Get to class on time. And finally, Indians, please help our campus look nice and clean. Throw your trash away. Don't pass it up. Pick it up. Up next is our student produced segments. Enjoy! Hey guys, today we are here at our Giving Thanks to the World event, an event featuring many of the different cultures with presentations about their heritage, culture, and much more. We are gathered here today with our students who are presenting to us about where they came from. So you know, we have Brazil, and today I'm going to be talking to you a little bit about our foods. Uh, Brazil is very known for, for its uh, vast culinary, and you know, uh, have you heard about the Brazilian uh, barbecue, or also churrasco? Yeah, it's very famous worldwide because of the steak. It's like very juicy and it's like sliced up and people just eat it together in a family. And we also have some foods right here. Here's some examples of Brazilian industrialized foods. These are mostly sweets and this is also like um, ramen. This is ramen and this is very famous like for you know, for the average Brazilian, we all, we all got these at home. And these are just some sweets. These are like candies, like chocolate based. And you know, this is what we take to school. This is what we eat. It's like, and, and yeah, that's Brazil. Thank you. Hey guys, we're here with my very own culture, the Philippines, and here we have these three people to tell us about it. Hi, okay, so the Philippines. Uh, it's a very beautiful place. We are called the Pearl of the Orient Seas. We are very much known for our beaches, and also we're known for our music. The Philippines is a very beautiful place. You should definitely go check it out in person. Um, the Philippines, like, social aspects is that it's from the continent of Asia. The official language is Filipino, but the main languages are Tagalog, Ilocano, and Masayan, and English. And we may know you from Valley Folklorico, but tell us a little bit about what Filipino heritage means to you. Uh, well, I grew up Filipino, like on my mom's side, so I really love uh, the Philippines and stuff. Uh, the food is very yum. The shows are very cool. Manny Pacquiao on top. Yeah. Right. <laughs> the Philippines is comprised of over 7,000 islands, so there's so many different cultures in every single province. It's like its own little country. Thank you so much for joining us here today. Thank, thank you. So you. Much. Yeah, thank you so much. Uh, Ingat!
That's it for today, Indians. Have a lovely day. In the silence of the desert, where the sands of silver shine, stands our glorious alma mater, tis our haven and our shrine.